I am the boy that never grew up, except I can't fly, which would be awesome. Because I'd like to be able to fly. I'm not sure what's best, actually, invisibility or flying. But, flying, flying is definitely best. I'm not sure what I'd do with invisibility. <laughs> 6 a.m., the alarm goes off. And if I get training by nine minutes past six, that gives me exactly a 45 minute window to train. So I can bosh off a 40 to 45 minute session. Then I've got time to jump in the shower, get me kit on, get me kit for later on, jump in the car and head on down to work. And we're on site, we start at half seven. Job's a dream. In the freezing cold, usually in the rain, but it's all right. in the morning, get along. I know uh, Christian's mum and dad socially, so I've known, known Christian since he was a little boy. But one of my first memories of Christian was I was talking to his granddad on the road side one day and Christian was cycling down towards us and he got to about 20 yards away and he stopped on his front wheel and he, he rode all the way towards us on his front wheel. And I thought, bloody hell, Bob's got a bit of talent. And then a few years later, his dad, uh, I think he was supermoto riding. I've got a gym, I used to box for years and I've got a gym at home and his dad asked me to, uh, to do some training with Christian, try and get him a bit stronger and fitter for his supermoto riding. And that when he was about 17, 18. And uh, we trained then for, Oh well, trained ever since, but uh, for a few years I think I was a bit fitter and then for, for a few more years we were about evens and then about five years ago he just left me for dead and I can't train with him anymore. I train with him but different levels altogether. Uh, as a bike racer basically all you've got to do is, is train, so you do your training and then what else are you going to do for the rest of the day? He's like hanging around at home. So I'm sure he doesn't have to work, but he does. He just comes and works for us. I mean, I say we train together. We quite often socialise. We just blow, you know. It's not that special about us. So it's a good way to keep grounded. It's a good way to keep it real because we are, you know, like in a very lucky position. It, it's, it's one of life's, you know, um, real workers. He works hard at everything he does and does the best he can. Me and Reese decided at lunchtime we were both that tired we were going to have a snooze. And someone actually came on site with the one time we ever decided we both we both got a pack of insulation each and decided we was having half an hour kit. And someone turned up. Sod the law, innit? No one's ever been on site before. And we're there, asleep. <laughs> I'll still do me, me days as and when, I'll, you know, when it comes up to a race weekend I'll probably stop on the Wednesday and then clean the caravan on Thursday and then we're there on the Friday so then you've got a race weekend, get back on Monday, send out me stuff and then back to work on a Tuesday and then once the season comes in obviously that is me bread and butter, the racing is the main thing and the racer I work for he knows that so um, he's dead good with me about that. He knows that racing comes first and everything, so it's no problem. He's great to have on site, really. He doesn't, doesn't moan. In fact, the harder, the harder the job is and the colder it is, the more we laugh. 
Oh, I'm going to have to remeasure that. There's no way that's going to fit. Right, cowboy builders, here we go. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, it doesn't. Oh. This is what happens when Christian didn't go his building. Oh, God. Fish back, Mark. Oh. Oh, surely you are not allowed on the road. Where's your registration plate, Treacle? Oh my God. There's a dude in a mobility scooter doing exactly three miles an hour up the main road. Man, I must have an overdrive function. He can no, surely no, wait, go wait, fast. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, we're waiting, we're waiting. Go, dude. Go. Oh, he's adjusting his mirror so he can see us. There we go. At least he's got safety in mind. Wave. Oh, he's happy, look. He's happy. <laughs> I wonder where he's going. I train at home in the morning because the gym's like 10 minutes away, which means that I'd have to then get up at 10 to 6, which is 10 minutes less sleep than I do enjoy my sleep. So, uh, yeah, train at home, pair of trainers, radio on. Uh, stopwatch there and then you can just crack on and do a load of stuff. I've got like uh, four or five different sets of training routines that I'll do in the morning and then in the evenings which we're probably going to go to later um, we're going to go to the gym. There's a lot more equipment in there so we can do a fair bit more stuff in the gym. Oh hold on actually I am a racer so I better tweet that I'm at the gym. Just one second. Yep. Send. Thankfully, because you boys are in, I get a bit of an early day, so I'm happy with that. Um, we've washed off the few jobs that we needed to do today. Um, weather's looking not so bad, so I reckon, not sure which way around we're going to do it, but I've still got another training session to do. I've done a bit of trials in, so we're going to go and do a bit of trials today, because that's probably the easiest thing we can go and do. I'm rubbish at trials. You might say I'm rubbish at other stuff as well, but I'm not so great at trials. I'm one of them where you have to like hit things in third gear and see if you can get over them, but... Yeah, we'll go for a play. It's cold. I'm one of them that likes to ride a lot, and the more that I ride, definitely the better I am. Um, which is often why the end of my season has come, usually seems to come, you know, come good. So I try and get on a bike as much as I can. It's not for fitness, because all the training that I do is the fitness side of things. That's more just the bike time, just to get get yourself sharp. I think it really just gets your mind focused. I don't really think it matters what you do. It could be, you know, dirt track or enduro or whatever. Um, as long as you're sat on a bike, that's all good, I reckon. Oh, I impressed myself then. <laughs> <laughs> 